but later. Jerry. Kevin, thanks so much. Happening right now, a problem in North Springfield has some people holding their noses. Neighbors say they are living near a couple who owns dozens of dogs and chickens, and all of them are locked inside the house. The neighbors say it smells so bad they can't enjoy their time outside. Houses in the 1600 block of Northampton. KSPR's Richard Robin joins us live from that neighborhood right now. And Rachel, can you smell anything from where you are? Yeah, Lee, when the wind picks up like it is right now, you smell a very strong, foul odor. It makes you want to pull one of these and plug your nose. And the people that live here say it smells like something died inside the house. They say at night it sounds like a kennel because all the dogs are barking. Now, the source of that smell is the house you're looking at right now. Yeah, it sounds like something died. We asked people to describe the smell, and they all say something like this. It was like a, a real bad smell, like animals of some kind, you know, yeah. and dead. You know, I haven't really smelled a human body, dead body before, but who's to know if there would be something like that there? Virginia Thompson says she spends a lot of time in the neighborhood visiting her friend, Linda Watkins, who lives right next to the smelly house. It's yeah. awful, and it gets worse if, if it's hot. So what are you, are you guys doing oh. in the summer? You can't even barbecue out here. No. <laughs> in case your food smells like the stuff that's next door. Neighbors say the couple who lives there rarely leaves home. We try to get in contact with them. So they have their front porch chained off, so we're not able to knock on their door, but we're going to call out to them and see if they come out. Mr. And we didn't have any luck. You can hear dogs inside, but it doesn't look like anybody's coming to the door. They've got cats and dogs, like almost like a kennel. And they never come outside. They never take, bring them outside to... Go to, to the bathroom, go to bathroom or, or anything. Yeah, um, so I've heard there's ducks and chickens too. Other neighbors we spoke to asked us to hide their identity. They say the sound of dogs barking is annoying, but the smell is the worst. It makes me angry. Um, you know, because I can't enjoy my home like I should be able to. They say they've called the police and the health department, but the smell is only getting worse. They told us they can't do anything unless they open up the door. A spokesperson for the Springfield Green County Health Department says they're working to figure out what options they have, and the department is also working with Springfield's Building Development Services. To see them get some help and, and get it cleaned up and, yeah be better for the community here because yeah. it's, 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 it's bad awful for everybody. Now, the last time police were called to this house was last Saturday, but they say they weren't able to go inside because they didn't have a warrant. Lee? All right, Rachel, thank you. Police say if you have a problem like this, you can report it by calling 911. A spokesperson for the city of Springfield says you can also report it to the Citizen Resource Center. That phone number is on your screen. It's 864-1010. Green County prosecutor